to solve this equation for n, let's start by multiplying everything by the least common denominator. So if you look at our denominators, we have m, n, and then if we consider p to be p over 1, we have 1. So the least common denominator would be m, n. So let's multiply everything in our equation by m, n. So we have m, n times 1 over m plus m, n times 1 over n equals m, n times p. So the m's cancel and we're left with n plus the n's cancel, we are left with m equals m n p. Since we're solving for n, let's subtract n on both sides so we can have the n's on one side of the equation. So m equals m n p minus n. So let's factor out n and we're left with m p minus 1 equals m and then we want to solve for n by dividing both sides by m p minus 1. So the m p minus 1's cancel out and then we're left with n equals m divided by m p minus 1. 